Okay, we have SAT test number two, section three, a no calculator section. And it looks like we have something here with x to the a to the squared divided by x to raised to the b squared equals x to the 16th power. And in this problem, it says x is greater than 1. So we also know that a plus b is equal to 2. So we'll probably have to use this here somewhere. The rules for exponents is that when you're dividing with the same base, you will have to subtract. So if I have x raised to the a squared power divided by x raised to the b squared power, then this would just be x equal to a squared minus b squared. And the answer here for this part is x to the 16th power. Which means that, it means that this exponent, a squared minus b squared, has to equal to 16. Because if the bases are the same here, then the exponents have to be equal to each other. And uh, if you remember, difference of squares, this right here is difference of two squares, a squared minus b squared. That will be a minus b times a plus b. And this is probably the most common form of factoring on the SAT. It's called difference of squares. And we are given already, we said we'll use this here, a plus b equals 2. So if a plus b equals 2, and uh, we need to find what is a minus b. This is the question that we need to answer. So a minus b times 2 is equal to 16. So if we divide by 2 on both sides, you will find out that a minus b is 16 divided by 2, which is 8. Is there an answer here that uh, looks like 8? Yeah. Uh, looks to me like answer A is 8, and that is the correct answer. Booyah! Now, if you're new to this channel, go ahead and subscribe, and make sure you hit the bell for notifications. And if you like this uh, video, make sure you leave a comment down below, and uh, let me know what city you're from. Uh, if you're from Sacramento, California, and, or if you're from Miami, Florida, just post where you're from and, and uh, we'll have a shout out for you. Thank you very much for watching this video. This will be it for today. Thank you.